Good morning students. Welcome again here in this video tutorial. Myself Nashima Khan and students as you all of you know that we are discussing our chapter number 11 Forest of India. Student this is lecture number 3 and I have already explained in my lecture number 2 that how many types of forest are found in India. So tell me how many types of forest? Yes. Yes. There are five main types of forest found in India. Now let's come here student. The number one is coniferous forest. Which forest? Coniferous forest. Number two, deciduous forest. Number three, evergreen forest. Number four, thorn forest and number five tidal forest so these types of main forest are found in india now student just look at the map very carefully with the help of this map we will learn in which part of india we found these types of forest let's start with coniferous forest so students, I have already told you that these forests are mostly covered with tall and cone-shaped trees and with needle-shaped leaves. Which types of trees? Yes, tall and cone-shaped trees with needle-shaped leaves. And what are the examples? Tell me, I have already told you that. Yes, pine, deodar and Oak trees. Which were trees? Again, yes. Pine, deodar and oak. Yes, pine, deodar and oak trees are the examples of coniferous forest. And coniferous forests are found in the Himalayan region. Just look at the map. This part, yes. This one. And here also and here also. So, which type of forest? Coniferous forest and yes, coniferous forests are found in the Himalayan region. Number two, deciduous forest. Which forest? Deciduous forest. Trees in these forests shed all their leaves for some time during the day and hot summer season in warmer climates of winter in cold climates when there is scarcity of water and what are the examples yes tell me peak sal and shisham trees which which trees are the examples of deciduous forest peak sal and shisham as you can see in this map also, deciduous forest. Yes, deciduous forests are found in the most areas of the southern plateau. Yes, most of the southern plateau. Ye jo aapka southern plateau ka most area hai, waha aapka konsa forest hai? Deciduous forest. Just look at here, green one. Number two, deciduous forest. And Foothills of the Himalayas. Ya apka foothills hai Himalayas ka. So, dekhe kitna large part of our country. Aapka kafi large part kaun se forest se covered ho raha Deciduous forest. Which forest? Deciduous forest. Just look at the map again here. You can see this light green part. As you can see in this map. This area. Yes, most area of the southern plateau and in the foothills of the Himalayas. Here also, this one and here also. So, got it? Number two, deciduous forest. And which which are the examples? Tea, sal and shisham. Now, let's come here. Evergreen forest. Which forest? Evergreen forest forest dark green as you can see in this map also this part this one this one and here also and you know what 
बेटा एवर ग्रीन फॉरेस्ट यस ट्रीज इन दीज फॉरेस्ट रिमेन ग्रीन थ्रू आउट द एयर एंड वट आर द एग्जाम्पल्स रोजवुड इबोनी एंड महोगोनी आर सम एवर ग्रीन फॉरेस्ट विच विच वन रोज वुड एज यू कैन सी रोज वुड इबोनी एंड महोगोनी दिस वन एंड यू नो एवर ग्रीन फॉरेस्ट आर फॉर्म इन वॉर्म एरियाज विथ plenty of rainfall so aise kaun se area hai aapke jo warm bhi hai and saath plenty of rainfall bhi hai wahan yes western ghat as you can see western ghats and in the north eastern state yes here north eastern states of india such as assam arunachal pradesh meghalaya and tripura and western ghat a little bit here also eastern ghat here western ghat and a little bit eastern ghat and north eastern states of india such as assam arunachal pradesh meghalaya and tripura next one number 4 thorn forest which forest thorn forest you know these forests are found in areas with very little rainfall short and thorny trees such as kikar and babul yes which which one kikar and babul and thorny shrubs grow in such forests which which one kikar and babul and you know just look at here thorn forests are mainly found in the rajasthan also just look at the yes thorn forest are mainly yes i am talking about mainly thorn forest are mainly found in rajasthan as you can see in this map this one also got it which forest thorn forest and in some parts of the deccan plateau also ye aapka some part dikh raha hai deccan plateau ko so thorn forest which forest thorn forest are mainly found in the rajasthan and in some parts of the deccan plateau also now number 5th tidal forest which forest tidal forest student tidal forest is also known as marshy forest which forest marshy and tidal forest blue part okay these forests are found in the deltas of rivers such as ganga mahanadi and godavari aapke deltas banate hain jo which which rivers such as ganga mahanadi and godavari and ganga delta is known as sundarbans all of you know that i have already explained it maine samjhaya hai aapko ganga delta is also known as sundarbans after the sundri trees that grow there which trees that grow there sundri tree blue part okay as you can see here this one then here also then a little bit here also then here this one also so number 5 tidal forest which forest tidal forest and where we found yes we found in the deltas of rivers such as ganga mahanadi aapka yahan deltas bante hain jo aapke rivers banati hain such as ganga mahanadi and godavari so on deltas mein hame kaun se forest aapke we found yes we found tidal forest and after the sundri trees that grow there students our next topic is conservation of forest and wildlife which topic conservation of forest and wildlife you have seen that deforestation leads to soil erosion here two words come here deforestation and soil erosion just take a quick recap because i have already explained in our previous which chapter yes previous chapter soils of india soil erosion you know sometimes the fertile top layer of the soil is carried away by wind and water to a different place yes from what yes carried away by wind and water 
कभी कभी क्या होता है कि आपकी जो सॉइल होती है एक जगह से दूसरी जगह कैरी होती है विद द हेल्प ऑफ विंड एंड वाटर टू अ डिफरेंट प्लेस सो दिस इज कॉल्ड सॉइल इरोजन एंड यू नो इट मेक्स द लैंड इनफर्टाइल रूट्स ऑफ प्लांट्स होल्ड द सॉइल टुगेदर एंड प्रिवेंट सॉइल इरोजन किसके रूट्स रूट्स ऑफ प्लांट्स रूट्स ऑफ ट्रीज क्या करती हैं सॉइल को होल्ड करती हैं जिस वजह से आपका क्या प्रिवेंट होता है सॉइल इरोजन एंड वी कट ट्रीज बट नाउ अ डेज एज यू ऑल ऑफ यू नो दैट वी आर कटिंग ट्रीज यस हम डे बाय डे ट्रीज को क्या करते जा रहे हैं ट्रीज को कट करते जा रहे हैं फॉर आर डेली पर्पसेस अपनी डेली नीड्स के लिए अपनी डेली नीड्स को फिल करने के लिए फुलफिल करने के लिए वी कट ट्रीज फॉर even fuel also so we cut trees for fuel and to build farms cities and roads this is called deforestation and deforest deforestation causes an increase in soil erosion jab aapke trees kam ho jayenge so trees kam ho jayenge to is wajah se aapka kya hoga soil erosion bhi zyada hoga and लैंडस्लाइड्स एंड फ्लड्स आर कॉमन इन डिफॉरेस्टेड एरियाज जब आपके यहाँ वहाँ सॉइल इरोजन ज़्यादा हो रहा है सो डिफॉरेस्टेशन डिफॉरेस्टेशन ज़्यादा हो रहा है ट्रीज ज़्यादा कट हो रहे तो वहाँ क्या होता है लैंडस्लाइड्स होता है एंड फ्लड्स वो कॉमन हो जाते हैं डिफॉरेस्टेशन ऑल्सो लेट्स टू रिडक्शन इन द एनिमल पॉपुलेशन बट यस डिफॉरेशन आपका और क्या बढ़ाता है रिडक्शन हो जाते हैं वहाँ एनिमल्स के भी क्योंकि ट्रीज कम हो जाएंगे फॉरेस्ट कम हो जाएंगे तो वहाँ ऑब्वियसली बेटा वाइल्ड एनिमल्स की भी पॉपुलेशन क्या हो जाएगी रिड्यूस हो जाएगी रिडक्शन हो जाएगा इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर अस टू सेव आर फॉरेस्ट बाय प्रिवेंटिंग ट्रीज from being cut and planting more trees yes it is very important things yes it is important for us to save our forest hame apne forest ko kya karke rakhna chahiye save karke rakhna chahiye by preventing wo kaise save honge apne jo hamari trees hain wo taki cut na ho aur hum trees zyada plant kare you know in 1974 when in 1974 villagers and the hills of uttarakhand started a novel method of preventing deforestation ek novel method start kiya tha yes by whom by the villagers and the hills of uttarakhand and when इन 1974, 1974 में जो विलेजर्स के विलेजर्स थे कहाँ के उत्तराखंड के उन्होंने प्रिवेंट करने के लिए डिफॉरेस्टेशन को रोकने के लिए एक नॉवल मेथड स्टार्ट करा उन्होंने पता क्या करा दे पुट दे आर्म्स अराउंड ट्रीज हक दैम टाइटली एंड रिफ्यूज टू मूव उन्होंने क्या करा बहुत सारे लोगों ने एक दूसरे के हैंड जो है होल्ड करे और हैंड को होल्ड करने के बाद जो है ट्रीज के जो है अपने आर्म्स पूरे राउंड में पुट कर ली और उन ट्रीज को बिल्कुल टाइटली हक कर लिया बिल्कुल टाइटली हक करने के बाद इट मीन्स यानी कि गले लगाने के एज यू कैन सी दैट जब हम किसी को गले लगाते हैं बहुत टाइटली करते हैं तो वैसे ही उन्होंने ट्रीज को बिल्कुल टाइटली हक कर लिया और उसके बाद बिल्कुल मना कर दिया कि हम नहीं हिलेंगे और ये ट्रीज बिल्कुल कट नहीं होंगे दिस मोमेंट वॉज लेट बाय सुंदर लाल बहुगुना यस हु यस सुंदर लाल बहुगुना दिस मोमेंट वॉज लेट बाय सुंदर लाल बहुगुना इट वॉज नोन एज द चिपको मोमेंट अभी मैंने आपको बताया उन्होंने एकदम गले लगा लिया उन ट्रीज को बिल्कुल चिपक गए वो उन ट्रीज से सो दैट्स वाई दिस मोमेंट इट वॉज नोन एज द चिपको मोमेंट विच मोमेंट चिपको मोमेंट एंड वेन इट वॉज स्टार्टेड इट वॉज स्टार्टेड इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी फोर वेयर यस इन द हिल्स ऑफ उत्तराखंड एंड बाय होम विलेजर्स अ नोवल मैथड ऑफ प्रिवेंटिंग डिफॉरेस्टेशन नाउ The government encourages people to plant tree in various way. A government भी एनकरेज कर रही है पीपल को टू प्लांट मोर ट्रीज इन वेरियस वे सच एज सेलिब्रेटिंग वन महोत्सव इन द बिगनिंग ऑफ द रेनी सीजन विच महोत्सव 
वन महोत्सव यस विच महोत्सव वन महोत्सव एंड वेन इन द बिगनिंग ऑफ द रेनी सीजन सो वेन वी सेलिब्रेट वन महोत्सव यस एवरी ईयर वी सेलिब्रेट वन महोत्सव इन द बिगनिंग ऑफ द रेनी सीजन एंड यू नो द गवर्नमेंट एनकरेजेस पीपल टू प्लान ट्रीज similarly under the social forestry scheme of government which scheme yes social forestry scheme of government rural people are encouraged to plant more trees for wood fuel fodder and timber rural people ko kafi encourage kiya jata hai ki wo kafi plant kare trees aur unko taki kya benefits ho unko wood fuel fodder and timber easily mile Student, just look at the picture also given. Sundarlal Bahuguna. Yes, whose picture? Yes, Sundarlal Bahuguna. Yes, and Chipko movement villagers prevent a tree from being cut and Chamoli Uttarakhand. Just look at the tree and villagers also stand here. The yes, उन्होंने क्या किया? इस तरह अपने hands को hold कर लिया और trees को पूरा round करके अपने arm से बिल्कुल hug कर लिया. to prevent deforestation and conserve wildlife the government has declared several areas as reserve forest so deforestation ko aur wildlife ko conserve karne ke liye yes deforestation ko prevent karne ke liye and wildlife ko conserve karne ke liye government ne kya kiya some several areas reserve forest cutting of trees and killing of wildlife in these forest is not permitted so jo unka reserve forest tha wahan bilkul trees cutting allowed nahi ki thi and killing of wildlife hunting of animals kya karte hain animals ko hunt karne ka bilkul permission nahi di gayi they are known as wildlife sanctuaries but they are known as yes several areas which are yes government has declared what several areas and cutting of trees and killing of wildlife in these forest is not permitted so they are known as wildlife sanctuaries and national park but they are known as they are known as wildlife sanctuaries and national parks some of them are as follows so corbett national park which park corbett national park and it is located in uttarakhand kajiranga national park where in assam sundarbans tiger reserve where in west bengal gir national park which park gir national park where gujarat kana national park and where madhya pradesh and in karnataka bandepur national park where in karnataka bandepur national park perrier wildlife sanctuary which sanctuary perrier wildlife sanctuary and where it is located yes it is in kerala chilka lake bird sanctuary which sanctuary which bird sanctuary chilika lake bird sanctuary and we are in odisha so that's it all of you that's it student thank you all of you have a nice day ahead